So in the last video, I unboxed a couple of rare coated pull stations, and in this video, I've got them all wired up, and we're going to be testing them. On the far left here is the Edwards coated pull station. This one was already in my collection, but I figured we'd go ahead and test that one today as well. Its code is 25. You can kind of see it on the top there. Going over to the right, we have the Acme coated pull station that's in the middle. And this one, if you remember, was from 1964, and its code is, as you can see right in the middle, 221. The thing about this pull station that I found out is it has a normally closed circuit, which can make things a little bit difficult when you're trying to wire it up like how it is right now. So in order to wire it up, I do have two power supplies, and one of them goes to a relay, which you can kind of see behind the horn there. That's a relay back there. And that basically allows me to change it so that it has a normally open circuit. Going over, we have the couch coated pull station. I did not open it up on video, but I'll go ahead and do that now. You, there is a hex key port in the top, and I already do have it unlocked, and here's the inside. So I did figure out that this pull station was likely made sometime in 1964, and that's because the inspection tag here is dated to 10 13 of 1964 and going to the right it also has a model number here and that is F650T so there it is and there's the inside and then for a horn I wanted to do a vintage horn so I have a notifier 34-24 mechanical horn and on it I do have a flush mount trim plate here so this will be going off once we pull these different alarms and hear the different codes. So let's go ahead and do that today. Let me make sure the power supplies are both working here. All right, let's start off with this couch code to pull station here. Its code is 452. If you want to learn more about coded pull stations or if you don't know why they are the way they are or how they work, then definitely go check out the other video that I made all about coded pull stations. But for now, let's go ahead and activate it. Here we go. There it is, 452. And then the gears just automatically stop. All right, let's give this one a spin here, the Acme Fire Alarm Pole Station. Here we go, code 221. Open up the door, and let's pull down. Alright, and then we'll give the Edwards code to pull station a pull. This is 2-5. Here we go. That one is definitely the fastest of the three. So now I'm going to do something that's kind of unique. I've never seen this done before. I'm going to pull all three of these pull stations at the same time. And the horn is just going to be receiving so many different codes, it's just going to sound whack. <laughs> Alright, here we go. I'll pull them down a little further this, this time too. That's kind of funny for a little bit there, it just sounded totally random, like it had no idea what it was doing. 
All right, everyone, I think that's gonna conclude this video on testing out these new awesome coated pull stations. Thank you so much for watching. If you found any of this interesting, then definitely go check out some of my other videos. But for now, rate, comment, and subscribe, and please have a great day.